I'm going to cut down a Wonderland 222 notebook that I had in my collection just sitting there. This is a pocket filled note weekly that I had in this cover. That cover is kind of larger than the pocket uh, moleskin, which is a three and a half by five and a half. It'll fit two books. It'll definitely fit the weekly and the daily. I just wanted an extra little notebook to have with the weekly. So I am just taking out the stuff that I could save in this old book that I use. I did not use a whole bunch of pages. I'm just going to take a si some signatures out. When I did do that, um, the book just kind of like tore at that first page. So if you see me just pull it out, that page once I pulled it the whole book just wanted to kind of come open which is telling me that they did not use enough glue or they it would never have done that in like a Hobonichi or Astrology but I do know that Wonderland did have some problems I think last year with their books so um, I do believe they rectified it though Either way, my solve was to go ahead and take out the pages and then bring some packing tape later on to kind of salvage it. The packing tape will hold it together. The way that it came apart, it didn't, it just came apart for the first page, like the first, that green cover page, like just kind of wanted to rip all the way off, which was so crazy. So, um, yeah, you'll see me cut this down. I'm using just the weekly moleskin to rough it and measure it that way. I always use another book to lay on top of what I want to cut and just kind of measure it that way. Yeah, I have a ruler and yeah, I could measure it the correct dimensions, but I don't never do it. Um, I mean, I just use the ruler to help hold the book in place while I'm cutting also, this book is Tomo River Paper, and I forgot, and um, when I was reusing my box cutter that needs to be replaced, the blade, it just kind of ripped through the pages really ugly, so I had to go and uh, fix that later on in the video, you will see. So anyhow, I'm going to play a little bit of music and then come back and talk to you guys about some things. I did get a rough chop. What I forgot was that when you're working with Tomo River paper, you have to cut really slow. So I was fine up until I got like right here. So all I'm gonna do is just like cut the edges off a little to where it's not looking crazy. And then also my blade is the issue. I literally need to get a new blade. This is ridiculous. But it doesn't do this to my astrology one. 
it only does it to this because it it's thinner paper and I went in all Rambo and forgot about that. Sorry, my kids are watching a movie. So you can fix it with like like I just did with like um the scissors. But again, um I want this for like just a like a like a random little notebook. Um I could just take with me. I really just You know what I mean? It's not like the biggest deal in the world. So, I was going to put it in this cover. I might do this. This is a weekly mole skein. And I can, t I can leave, I can go right where I left off, which is here. I could start April right here if I want. And just kind of throw it in this because this is a chunky book it will hold both yeah so we'll make note that when i was taking the signature out the glue from this just it just tore off so i heard they ha are having problems or had last year um wonderland 222 with their the way they made their books because that shouldn't have happened it shouldn't have just yanked out so i put packing tape so i'm literally just going to glue that page to that page or you know just kind of you know, have to take this out so you could see right there look that came off the whole entire book that is like not cute um, I have bought a few from them before and that has happened to each and every one that I have bought. Mm -hmm. These ones, and, and it's important for me to tell you that I have a lot of books in my collection that are just sitting. So that's, oh man, crap. Oh well, I'm doing it all jacked up. So that's why I can just cut down books and do stuff like that this should hold and so it's not so entirely ugly i can probably grab some washi and cover it all up um but i do have a lot of different books that i have either started or stopped throughout the years and yeah, so I did, it doesn't bother me to like cut things down and I always kind of make it work. So if I don't really want to use this anymore, I can just put it on my shelf and use it for whenever I want to. So it's just not a big deal in my opinion. So all I'm going to do is just kind of try and cover this the best way I can, you know, and then provide some more, uh, structure, so it's just cute little, cute little card, and that was inside the, um, book before. Just put that there. This was the other one. I highly doubt I can salvage this. This I probably can right here. To like possibly put it in the front of the book with like some washi. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> There's paper everywhere. Just take it off. Why not? Have fun in paper, right? So 
so like if I just put that down, I can get like a little um, paper clip. This color is throwing me off. And even this too, I can put that little thing there. Courage is nothing more than taking one more step than you think you can. So I could kind of just pull this back, put that there too. And you just kind of like pull this all the way back with like a paper clip. Let me see. these so I'm gonna just put that like that put some washi down for this one this I don't think I'm gonna be able to salvage but I could possibly use it for something else you know what I mean because the, the cross I could possibly use that for someone else. So, I like this, y'all. Um, I'm just going to glue this. Just kind of glue it right there. I probably need to get a different little... Um, the poor little thing needs to be completely chopped. So, I mean, not chopped clean, or probably a new one. So, I would have the little weekly that I was using. So, this is why I make things like kind of undated, so I can come back. Last time I used this was February, so I can come back right. Here, here's March, here's April, you know. Then I did have this pulled back to like the current month, right? I'll just do that for purposes. So I have it pulled back. There's trackers, important reminders, and then I can go into the weeks. So if I want to go and maybe go back plan all of the, so this is the last time I used it going into March. So if I want to do the last three weeks or just head right into April, I can. So cute. 